<clears throat> hello, hello, party people. So I'm going to take this time to explain some certain things about the channel. As far as I know, there's nothing that doxes me. There's, there's nothing private. This is all readily available on YouTube. Now, some people might ask me, the second from the bottom right here. I don't know if you can see that, but uh, this this one over here. Um, for some reason, you can't see the cursor. And okay, um, there's six videos in this gambling adventure playlist, right? I wonder why there aren't more. I don't. I don't think this this might not be common knowledge. It is illegal to post gambling stuff from a company you're not associated with. You're not sponsored by, not under contract by. Would I love to be a part of that? Of course. But at the moment, I can't just show myself gambling on recording, on stream, anywhere. Because the last time I checked, the government doesn't own a casino. The last time I checked, there are indigenous American tribes that own casinos. I don't know if Native Americans is a politically correct term anymore. But let's let's uh, move on. Let's move on. There. Okay, so um, okay, TCB Gaming dash PC, right? How many times have I said I need to work on my Steam account more? Do I have that kind of time? No. Do I wish I did? Of course. But like, starting a new game, finishing a new game, like. This shit takes time. I don't think you guys realize. And like, do you, would I ideally want it to be enjoyable for myself? Of course. How many... I, this is not my main source of income. I can't stress that enough. But like... Of course, everyone would like a job that, that they're happy with. That brings them enjoyment. Is that a reality? Only in certain cases, unfortunately. And, uh... If we look at... Okay, okay, let's check this to be a Pokemon master, right? There's only nine videos in this place. I might just get another pack and just record the opening of it just to have even 10 videos there. Opening these packs, especially to make them interesting, I actually get a good card. We're talking like dozens, if not hundreds of dollars. In some people's cases, thousands of dollars. And like, do I want to invest that much in that? No. But do I want it to be a part of my channel? It wouldn't be there unless I did. Now, if we go to, uh, let me see here, um, okay, so, where is it, where is it, I'll show you guys where it is. Okay, if you look at, um, TCB Gaming dash PS as in PlayStation, and PS5 Genshin Impact playlist, right? There are almost as many videos about every other PlayStation game I've recorded or commentated about as there are just videos about Genshin Impact. Just Genshin Impact alone. Um, I, I don't know how to emphasize that more than enough. We'll get better through that later. Now, if you look at TCB on that gym life, right? Only five videos on there. Do you think it's okay if you just post the camera and just put it in front of yourself working out? According to other people's channels, which may or may not be more popular than mine, for their channels, yes, it's fine. For me, who just joined a different gym, like, I don't have that level of rapport with the owner yet. I don't even come in contact with the owner for that, that much um, indication when I, the rare cases that go there in the daytime. I go there because it's open 24 hours, and in about an hour and a half, I'll be there. And there would be that same dude there who I made a video about who doesn't seem to enjoy his job. Let me just put it that way. I'll, I'll be honest about it. Um, but yeah, would, would I like more videos of me working out? I mean, if people are going to watch it, yeah. But like, like I'm, I'm not exactly the most jacked guy. That's all I'm saying. I mean, like, I understand that you don't need that to be, you know, to whatever your objective is to get views, get subs, whatever, like, I just feel like I'm not a part of that demographic. Maybe, I don't know, maybe I'm reading into it too much. But yeah, so those are the playlists I have with like the least number of videos and possibly the least number of views, I don't know, but 
Like, how, how many playlists we're we talking about? We're talking about twenty six playlists here, each a part of their own section, and there are subsections as well. So that's all I'm gonna say. Um, there is one more thing that I want to address is not a part of my analytics here. Can you call these analytics? I mean, technically, yes. Even though there's, this, there's a button right here that says analytics on it. I don't want to show you guys that because I don't want to show anybody that. Um, okay, so someone asked me why I don't stream or record certain games that could be potentially more entertaining for myself. And is that important to an extent? Of course. I'm just going to show you some figures here. This is all via Google right now. Just, you could look this up yourself. How much money did Final Fantasy VII Remake make? Alright. If you say they sold more than 7 million copies. right? Okay, let's let's do the math for right now. The, the price of that game when it first was first released was probably $70. Okay, so let me, let me get out my little calculator here. If you take 7 million and you multiply that by $70, right? That game has generated $490 million possibly on just a remake alone. Just the first, we're not talking about Rebirth, we're not going to talk about Crisis Core, we're talking about just Final Fantasy VII Remake. Now, in terms of the games that I do stream, that I do record on, Diablo 4 made more than a billion dollars that includes in-game transactions that are not pay to win now last time i checked a billion dollars is twice as much as 490 million dollars but hey you know there's just numbers right okay now how much money has minecraft made a game that you know i only vaguely know about but do I, do I record it no is the reason why i mean i have my preconceived preconceived judgments about this game just like anyone else would um does a certain demographic play these games only no there are plenty of adults out there who play this game and like i i can understand why like in terms of if you were playing with your friends etc in my opinion this is my opinion there are more minors playing this game than there are adults that's my opinion. I don't have any factual evidence to back that up. But you know, maybe it's out there on Google somewhere. Um, in 2022 alone, this game made $350 million. Okay. Uh, in 2021, for example, right here it says right here, $380 million. 2020, $450 million. 2018, $500 million. That all seems to be above... A, Anything that Final Fantasy VII Remake generated. We're not talking about Final Fantasy XI. We're not talking about fourteen, Because in my opinion, fourteen was a sleeper success. Like, people play that game still. They're still releasing content for that game. Now, if I went to Final Fantasy Intergrade, right? Final Fantasy VII Intergrade. Is there still new content coming out? Is there still DLC coming out for Final Fantasy VII Remake? Besides the Yuffie DLC. Show me. Show me where the Vincent Valentine DLC is. Show me that. Okay. Genshin Impact. A game that I enjoy. That I enjoy recording streaming about. A free to play game. A gacha game. Has made 3.7 billion dollars. That is... Okay, let's, let's figure this out, right? right? Okay, okay. Now... 490 million go, goes into what 3.7 billion uh let's just do let's just do the math here right? let's just do the math 3.7 okay not million not, not 3.7 million 3.7 billion okay now if we take that we subtract that from 490 million Genshin Impact has still generated 3.2 billion more then Final Fantasy Remake. Final Fantasy VII Remake. $3.2 billion more. So, do you get what I'm saying in terms of the money generated from these games? Because the more popular a game is, the more money it's going to make. I am I wrong here? Like, is it is it profit the incentive for, for most of these video game developers? 
I, I thought it was. I don't know. What the fuck do I know? Um, if you really want it to be mainstream, right? If we look up how much money Grand Theft Auto V, GTA Online supposedly, has made over $8.6 billion since it was released. Genshin Impact is going into four years. And it is nowhere close. Well, I guess it's like, what, a third of the way there? In terms of $8.6 billion compared to $3.7 billion. Why is no one asking me, why aren't you recording or streaming about Grand Theft Auto Online? Nobody is asking me that, you know? And you want to know why? Because it is saturated. That's just my opinion. I'm just saying. But like, if you're going to recommend a game to me, right? Uh, at the least make it a game that I would enjoy that I don't need to go back in terms of back to Final Fantasy 8, Final Fantasy 9, X, X2 like those are good games I, I played the majority of them. those are those are good games right in terms of right now what videos are being made about them what do you see on recording what do you see on Twitch on stream Who, how many people do you see that Okay, Rebirth just came out, right? Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. How many people do you see still, still streaming about for about um, Final Fantasy VII Integrated Remake? Even Crisis Core. How many people do you see streaming about those games? Are there people streaming about Rebirth? Because it's a newer game. Maybe because currently it's being supported. There is new content in Genshin Impact about like at least once every two months. These aren't small updates either. These are updates that generate billions of dollars. I, I, I'm just saying. If you're going to recommend me something. At, at least give me some reasons why. That game is worth more than this. I mean should I be streaming a recording about Grand Theft Auto? Probably. Is Grand Theft Auto a game that I personally super enjoy? That I personally love? No. It's not. If If... Why do you think you only see shit about Grand Theft Auto role-playing? About that mod on the PC? About, like, would it, would it be fun if I was, like, a police officer in Grand Theft Auto role-playing? And I just, I just went around arresting people. And, like, hypothetically, right? If I did that for a living, if I was a police officer for a living, why would I want to role-play as a police officer in a game? Because the last time I checked, games are supposed to be enjoyable. That does not sound enjoyable to me. Uh, I don't know. I mean, I've played some of the past Grand Theft Autos. Um, they're, they're okay. That's all I'll say about them. Um, back when Grand Theft Auto blew up, right? When it first came out. What, was, it, was it a hit? Of course. And if you look at the difference between uh, GTA 3, right? Uh, GTA Vice City, uh, San Andreas, like a lot of those games were not recorded and reacted to on stream and recordings on YouTube. The reason why Grand Theft Auto V is an exception to that is that it has the capability to do that. People are releasing mods for these games. As soon as you hear the word mods, you should think PC gaming right there. How much PC gaming do you see I do? Now, all I gotta say is this, right? All I gotta say is this. Don't tell me how to run my YouTube channel. Take care of yourselves, guys, and each other. Oh, sorry, guys, I forgot to record this part. We'll just add on towards the end. But, um, top 10 video games sales of all time, best selling. IGN.com, right? The Pokemon, uh, the first generation, 47 million. Super Mario Brothers on NES, 48 million. Overwatch, 50 million. Now, I think we're talking about the number of copies or dollars. Either way, the numbers don't change. The ratios do not change. I mean, were games like slightly different prices back then? Of course. Now, if we look at The Witcher 3, right? So many people have told me that I should do something with this game. And I appreciate that. But... We're talking about a game that can potentially take hundreds of hours just to platinum. We're not talking about enjoying it. We're talking about just the platinum. And is platinum a game on recording important to me? Or at least taking a step towards that? Of course. That's, that's part of the journey right there. Terraria? 
Have I ever played Terraria? Of course not. I say of course not because this game goes. Well, how old is this game? This this game came out in 2024, and with 32 million on PC alone. That's what it says there. The Elder Scrolls Skyrim. So, there have been a number of times where I tried to record and stream about this game. It's too slow for me. I I don't know how to explain that in any other way, but the game is just too slow for me. Like, the amount of video editing involved in that is staggering. Now, I don't like to play games. Let me explain. I don't like to play games off of recording or off of stream because if I am... I'm not working on these projects. I'm not working on something that could potentially generate revenue or popularity for that matter. It's just like, to me, it seems counterproductive sometimes. Sometimes for me, it seems counterproductive. Like all these easy platinums I do, that's just for dopamine and like there's my, the sheer enjoyment for myself because those are what, like half an hour platinums at, at most. Oh, it's a Red Dead too, right? How is it that some people still don't know that Red Dead 2 is a prequel to Red Dead Redemption, Red Dead 1? And if you're playing Red Dead 2 and you didn't play Red Dead 1, would it make sense to go in order? I mean, maybe? Is Red Dead 2 a better game than Red Dead 1? Of course. Now, has, is it more successful? Of course. Is it by the same people that made Grand Theft Auto? Did you, did, do people know that? Do people know that the open world system that they do in GTA Online is the same as what they do in Red Dead 2? Maybe not the exact same, but like pretty similar if you notice the, the quests and whatnot. Mario Kart 8 and Deluxe. Number 6 best selling game of all time. Mario Kart. Do, I, I should just be able to say Mario Kart and you should understand what I'm talking about. Okay, PUBG, me personally, never got into it. Is it better than other shooters out there that are, you know, do, you, do people realize PUBG is free to play? It became free to play. It says it right there. You guys can read this, right? If you want. Wii Sports. Again, Mario Kart, Wii Sports. You should know exactly what I'm talking if. Okay, okay, wait, wait. If you're a gamer, you know exactly what I'm talking about. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, then you're what we call casual. I'm not saying you had to have played all these games, but I'm just saying. I mean, everyone is entitled to enjoy the game they want to, of course. But in terms of making content that I personally enjoy, that I feel like other people would enjoy, and if they don't, this is still a hobby to me. I'm just get. I should get that like captioned at the bottom that that gaming is my hobby. YouTube is my hobby. Twitch is my hobby. Like that's so I'm saying. Grand Theft Auto Five right there, two hundred plus million. We're already talking about that. Minecraft three hundred million. We're already talking about that. Um, number one best selling game of all time, right? Tetris. Why do you think Tetris is the best selling game of all time? Because it's fun. I, I will never understand why people don't understand that. We're not talking about the best graphics. We're talking about gameplay only. And this, there are tournaments about this game still, still being held. And like, okay, okay, I get it. Maybe you're not into esports. Maybe like, like, do I personally? Dude, on YouTube, like, there's so many, like, like Tekken, like, Virtua Fighter, Street Fighter, all these, like, comp Mortal Kombat, competitive games that people are still making tournaments about. And if I'm going to watch a game and I have no intention of using it for any of my own personal ventures, I don't want to watch the people who are the best at that game because that's enjoyable for me. Not necessarily playing it, but watching it. I don't know. 
Now, maybe I had a point through all this and it was just, you know, glossed over, but I don't know. I don't know, man. But anyway, there's that. So here's a second outro for you. Uh, take care of yourselves and each other.